phenomenal. <laughs> and congrats uh, again to them. So many smiling faces. Yeah, going back to fifth, sixth grade in the next couple days, that's going to be right. a royalty treatment. Right. <laughs> the bragging rights for right. sure. Thank you, Ryan. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Visit Paget's Jewelers in Quincy to sell your valuables at our thrift. by WCTV.TV. Eyewitness News at 5.30 starts now. Expanding its curriculum, a look at a South Georgia college's new class that already has local health care providers. Asking when its students will graduate. Plus, community members come together today to remember the victims of a racist attack in Jacksonville one year later. <laughs> Buffer's foreign policy takes center stage as the Trump and Harris campaigns press on with 70 days to go until the election. Thanks for joining us tonight at 530, everybody. I'm Abby Walton. Zach has the night off. Today, former President Trump is attempting to tie Vice President Kamala Harris to the Biden administration's chaotic and deadly withdrawal of U.S. soldiers from Afghanistan three years ago. Skylar Henry has the details from the White House. Bruce. 